Hello there, my name is Kai Anderson. I use he, him pronouns, and I am the Equitable Development Director at Westside Community Organization. One exciting thing we're working towards uh, to put together in September is a shared education series about community wealth building strategies. And so we're uh, looking at uh, what Westsiders are saying are important around uh, tenant ownership, uh, cooperative housing, and community ownership. Uh, another important piece of my work is to reshape and help the scorecard team with some revisioning. And so within this process, uh, I'm meeting a, a lot of great people who've been involved in the scorecard work. The scorecard is an equi equity tool uh, that holds developers accountable to the community vision of the West Side. And then lastly, a really exciting thing that we're doing is we're thinking about community engagement and starting our uh, process for the West Side Small Area Plan. So the last time we did the Small Area Plan was 2013. And so coming up by the end of 2023, we want to uh, engage West Siders in what that plan will look like. So looking forward into the future uh, in terms of how we want to plan together on the West Side. Planning is often learned, urban planning is often um, when we look at sustainable development towards the future is this linear and rational, more calculated and measurable stats related um, story. And I think that in terms of truth telling, it's really important to lift up our lived experiences and that everyone is important in terms of the planning process. One thing I wanna share is I love the West Side. There's so much rich uh, cultural heritage that has been passed down here. And, and that includes the work of the West Side Community Organization. An interesting thing about how I got to the West Side is that I met Monica and West Side staff through a collaborative process involving um, the regional developments with the scorecard. So in the Twin Cities, uh, I helped co-facilitate by way of the Alliance for Metropolitan Stability, which Drew, he was a great mentor for me, uh, to uh, develop a BIPOC livability work group. And at Nexus, I was part of the North Star Black Cooperative Fellowship. And so I learned a ton of things about cultural practice, um, and how we come into it, and also how cooperative practice is something that's inside of us that we've always had, and I think that was something that was brought out. And so it's fun to share these uh, parts, these intersections as they come together and what we're trying to do together and in my role as the Equitable Development Director. One thing that's fun about my name is uh, in native Hawaiian language, it means child from the sea. And so uh, one thing that's important to me on my journey is self-transformation and to accompany others in this healing process of transformation. And so like water, I see my name and live in my purpose going towards healing and transformation and that type of remedy. Um, Another thing I would say that's just fun about me is sp my spirituality is very much involved in music. Uh, I've been a hip hop artist since I was a kid. It was a way for me to get an education when I felt education was failing me. Um, I love, although being a city person, I love the outdoors. I love hiking and sharing food with my neighbors and friends and family.